Okay, here comes the double ladder. Hard to say, I don't know, I'm not too positive on it, but we'll see. One, open. Second one, it's not coming. closed. What's in it though? I don't see a head. I, it's closed, closed. It's caught on the. There's a stick. It's caught on. It's just snapped. That's it, boys. Yeah, just snapped her. Nothing else. Shoot. Okay, I got antsy today. We're checking. So let's see what we got here. Pull the sticks up instead of the chain. This is the run set off the house. Oh, oh a muskrat. Holy Wow. That's awesome. I love that. You know why? Because there's so few rats. That's such a great sign that rats are coming back. We got a rat. That is so awesome. Yeah, we're after beaver, but we got a winter rat, boys. Okay, let's get that out of the trap before uh, it freezes in. Yes, that is a beautiful sunset. So, first day of checking. I was gonna wait till tomorrow to check and pull everything when I go back to work, but. So anyway, we didn't get it on video, but. So we got our muskrat, you guys seen that one. But here is the beaver. Pull him out so we can see him a bit. Come here, Leo. There, he's nice extra large. Do you have a light? Can shine on the fur here? Unfortunately, he is not quite the right color. He's a nice brown. He's got really good under fur. He's super prime. But I don't think he's going to grade as an extra dark. He shine right into the fur there. Beautiful. Yeah, you can see that brown, but the under fur is really nice oh, yeah. and dark. But he's still going to grade as a brown. He won't be that extra dark or dark brown, whatever they call that. And our muskrat is really nice, you know, brown winter rat. So, yeah, that's our first day of checking. We left the traps in. I'm going to pull everything tomorrow on my way back up to work when I'm logging. So we'll see what, if anything, happens tomorrow. Stay tuned. Okay, so our first day is done. Our muskrat is on the board, and it blows my mind it's the end of January. And that muskrat still has fall pattern on him. He's gonna grade as a fall rat. So, damn. I figured we had a good winter rat there, and it's just, for whatever reason, it's a fall. So, it is what it is. Now, Mr. Beaver. Okay, so Mr. Beaver has, you can see, that scar. Okay, so that's going to cause problem in the under fur. And then, you can see, down the center, he's still got some dark patches. Uh, then, right there. No idea, I didn't do it with a fleshy knife or anything. Just the smallest little, like not even the size of my pinky finger and a little hole in there for, I don't know exactly what popped, a little zit or something, but anyway, so probably going to grade slight or something like that. I'm not too sure. Maybe a slight damage, I don't know. He's definitely not a number one be uh, beaver anyway. Uh, but anyway, so that's what he looks like. You know, casters are done sitting there as well, so he'll dry when we uh, when I get back from uh, work the next shift. Then we'll kind of get an idea what it looks like. But I don't see a number one beaver here, so just is what it is. So I guess, like I was telling the other guys, they they went home already. I said it's pretty pretty rare to get a beaver and a number one beaver at the same time. So, but. There's what the winter beaver's starting to look like. So, all right, we'll keep trying.